Hi everyone and welcome to the post, as I straighten my shirt, post Christmas 2018 Knitting All the Blankets podcast. It's been a while. Yes it has. Um, I'm actually down on the floor, usually you guys know I'm over there because you can see my blanket. I'd actually set up the table with the intention of filming over there, but then I decided to change my mind because I did not want to move all of the lovely mini skein boxes from my from where they are sitting right here on my footstool over there. So this is just going to be a quick um, advent calendar unboxing, if you will. Um, for Christmas, my husband got me the Twin Mommy Creations mini skein advent calendar. I decided to wait until Christmas Day to open them all up. And then I decided Christmas Day, it's not Christmas Day, today is the day after Christmas, um, that I was going to do a video and show them all off. So, here we are. There will be a longer episode kind of filling you in on what I've been up to since the last time I podcasted and what my knitting plans are for 2019, but that will be coming later. Okay, first things first, before I get into my adorable little boxes of minis, I've opened one already just because I wanted to see what they looked like. But in addition to the Twin Mommy Creations Advent Calendar, um, I, my husband also got me um, the Mystery Minis Pack, and that is right here. There's crinkling, I'm sorry. And no, I don't know what the colorway names are. I have put in a message to Anne for her to get me those. And once I get them, I will label these. And if I get them in time for the next video, I'll share them. Anybody that's wondering, yes, my Christmas tree is changing from white lights to colored lights. So our tree does that because I like that. So if you think you're seeing something in the background, you are. All right, so Advent Mini Day 1, which I have already opened. And they're just adorable. I was very happy when I saw this because not only is it a wonderful little 40-yard mini, and the color is probably not going to do it justice right here, but it's beautiful. But I love that Anne labeled every single mini. So this is day one orchids. So love that. Try to stick it back in the box. So that's one. Day two. Maybe if I get my act together, I'll actually do Vlogmas next year and have these and do this, like, properly. Okay, the second one. Oh, and not only is it day two mulberry, which is a nice, deep, purpley one, but I got two little stitch markers. Those are cool. I know it takes her a while to make these, so that's awesome. So that was two. Day three. And this one is Bittersweet October, and it's um, shades of brown actually and there's some speckles oh it's pretty now the OCD part of my brain will tell me that uh, when I do eventually put these in my mini skein blanket they need to be in order we'll see what happens so day four she stapled these really well uh oh Another goodie. Just Be You pin. That was sweet. And this one is Heather. 
It's kind of a gray purpley one. I probably should have done this next to the window. Day five, let me put my, my pin back in there so I don't lose it. This one is granite. Oh, that one's lovely. She, uh, and as you guys know, um, I'm just gonna open number six while I talk. You guys know that Anne is one of my very good friends, and she actually messaged me and said, "Hey, are you gonna open the advent calendar every day, or are you doing it all at Christmas? All at Christmas? Why?" She's like. Oh, I was just going to, like, do reveal photos, but I don't want to spoil it for you, so. Okay, and this is number six, and this is Harvest. Oh, I love this one. Oh, beautiful. Um, so I told her to figure out if there was a way to block me from seeing the photos. Day seven. So... If Anne was able to do that and you follow um, her Facebook page, I hope you guys have been enjoying seeing them because this is my first time seeing them. <laughs> All right, the extra prize this today is a sticker and it says Knit Happens. I'm so putting this in my planner. And for those of you that don't follow me on my other channel, uh, Tales from a Polk County Girl, that is my planner book and writing related uh channel and this one is citrus oh my god that's that's lovely that is lovely i'm like so excited okay number eight Come on. I'm trying to get not get the mini caught on the staples. All right, and this one is Haystack. That is a beautiful, tawny, light brown, tan one. It's beautiful. I'm so glad she started doing mini skeins. And this advent calendar. Okay, we're on day nine. Because y'all that have been following me for a while know I have a problem. Okay, and this one, uh-oh, and this one is Burning Man. Um, that means something to me in terms of not just the band and the concert, but if anybody watch, used to watch old Top Gear on BBC, and now if you watch the Grand Tour, Burning Man was, at, was in the pilot episode. Where's day 10? There's day 10. Day 10. Ah, another pin. Okay, this one's just swirly rainbows with a smiley face. There it is. Cute. Ouch. Faded Love, Faded Memories is the name of this mini skein gorgeous oh. and you do such fabulous work she'll eventually watch this video okay number 11 what, what time am I at okay nine minutes <laughs> my phone will only record for like 25 maybe 30 minutes so all right so day 11 Ooh, this is another light one one is straw. So it's a more yellowy version than haystack. There's more, to me, there's more yellow in this um, than tan. Very nice. And when they're all open, I'm gonna take an overhead shot because they're all like kind of peeking out of the bags a little bit like that. I'm just gonna put that up on the Crafts by Corey Facebook page. 
which um, if you want to follow me there, that's when I upload pictures of when I'm working on knitting projects, etc. Okay, day 12, we have another pin. And this one just says, got fiber. I'm going to have so many pins from her. Oh, this one's nice. Meadowlark. It's gr it's grays and some um, kind of really light gray, almost white with some yellow. Ooh, I wonder if this is self-striping. If it is, this is going to be amazing. Even if it's not, it's going to be amazing no matter what. Okay. Day 13. And I do love that she used um, little paper uh, bag things because I can just throw them all in the recycling bin. Very ecological. Uh, this is, okay, day 13, smoky halo circled. But it says dot, dot, dot. So I may need to message her about that because I don't understand that one. But this one is just shades of green. It's, oh, it's lovely. I can't wait. I mean, you guys know I have a mini skin addiction anyways, so God only knows when I'll get these put in, but anyways. Okay, and okay, so day 14. Oh my God, under the glacier. Look at that blue. I love that. Oh, I love the shade of blue, teal, and then the blacks and grays. Oh, I love it. She knows I love that blue, too. Okay. Day 15. Ooh, what are these? These are... I think these are needle stoppers, but I'm not entirely sure, to be honest. I'll have to message her about them because they're foamy. I can squish down on them. I think they're needle stoppers. But I don't know. <sighs> Another blue one. This is Glimmer on the Surface. And that's like a really dark aquamarine. Oh my god, it's beautiful. Love it. All right, 15 down, 10 to go. Oh yeah, excuse my hair. My hair looks awful. Day 16. Ooh. Uh-oh, got caught on a staple. Too much fun. Oh, and that is too much fun. Just look at the color variations and all of this. Oh, that's gonna that's gonna be so much fun to knit up. So my husband was teasing me when it came comes to all my minis. Um, cause he he asked me, he's like, so we're on day seventeen. So how big are you gonna make this mini skein blanket? And I said something, we have a king size bed. I said, well, maybe I'll make it king size. He's like, I think you have more minis than that. Which may be true. So maybe I'll have to make another one. Okay, and I got um, another pin. And this one says, not all who wander are lost. I hope that's coming out the right way. And this one speaks to me so much. Love told that. Tolkien saying. This one is Know Who You Are, Te Fiti. That might be a Moana reference, to be honest. I'm not entirely sure, but it's this one looks volcanic to me. It really does. So, Anne, when you do watch this, if you could like comment and tell me when I'm right and when I'm wrong, and I'm probably completely wrong, that'd be helpful. Put my little pin back in there. Day 18. Doo, 
Do, 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 do. Okay, and this one is denim. It's a nice dark blue. It, it, there is blue in there. I know it probably kind of looks black, but it is a very dark, like, um, like a dark wash pair of jeans. That's what this looks like. All right, day 19, and I dropped it. Another sticker. And it is one of her I Like Big Balls um, stickers. I have a maturity level of five-year-old, so ha-ha. Uh-oh. And this one is tambourine with a silver jingle. I want to know where she comes up with her colorway names. She'll probably never tell me, but they're just fabulous. Put my sticker in there. Day 20. And to be perfectly honest, I had no idea how these were going to be packaged. When she uh, dropped it off at my house, because we live like two blocks from each other, like I said, my husband uh, was giving me this for Christmas. She went ahead and wrapped the damn thing for him. So he didn't have to do anything. So I had no idea until I took the tissue paper out of it yesterday morning that they were even in these little cartons. Berry pie. Oh, that's so pretty. It's like purpley and blue. It reminds me of blueberry pie, actually. It's got some flecks of the uh, that light blue right there. I hope that's coming through. That was day 20. Twenty-one. Ah, I got another pin. This one says geeky before it was cool. And to go along with it is Swampy Stroll. So why it was a like a plain mini that she just flecked and got some color on. I've had the privilege of hanging out at her studio while she's been made not while she was making these but while she's made minis in the past so I kind of know what she does a little bit so it's fun to look at her minis and go okay well she probably did this she probably did that I personally have no desire to start dyeing my own yarn why would I Anne lives two blocks from me her studio's another two blocks away why why would I do it She's my own personal yarn store. So day 22. Not that I don't love all my Florida Indie Dyers. Sticker. Yarn snob. And uh, as funny as this is, I actually do not consider myself a yarn snob. Um, I do like, I do appreciate good yarns. But I just know what I like. All right, and this one is, it's electric. She should have added the boogie woogie onto the end of there. That's very pretty. That's, it's like Tinkerbell green or Slimer green, you know? So all these stickers are gonna go in my planner. They just are. Actually, I may create, since my planner has I can change out the cover in it. I may just get a, cut down a piece of cardstock and put all the stickers on that. Day 23. Almost at the finish line, people, so thank you for hanging with me. What time am I at? I'm at 19 minutes. Okay. Glare from the window is blocking where the time is right there on my phone. Ooh. Aww. This one's a progress keeper, and I love progress keepers too. And this one says, it says, be your own fabulous self. 
I can't wait to add that to my Progress Keeper collection. Because with the mini skein 10 stitch blanket, I'll explain more in the next actual podcast video. Um, but I, I used up almost all of my Progress Keepers. Okay, so day 23 is Seafoam. And yes, that is very much seafoam grain. And day 24. And I can't wait to open day 25 because it's a bigger thing. If you can see the little red thing right here, that's day 25. And another pin. It is her Got Fiber pin, and this is her Twin Mommy Creations pretty much logo on her Facebook page. So, love it. This is her Party Time colorway, and actually the colors, I think that's what's in this, in this pin. Look at the colors there. Now look at this mini. I think it's the same thing. No, I'm wrong, but it looks the same to me. I almost dropped the pen. But yay! Oh, this is so much fun. I love mini skins. And dun dun dun. Number 25. This one isn't stapled, which is nice. Because it's a nice bag. Oh, she taped it. And this one is a bigger mini. This is 87 yards and it is Wooded Wonderland. Oh my God, this one may not go in the blanket. I don't know what I'm gonna do with an 87 yard mini. I'm gonna do something with it, but oh my God. I need to find a, maybe I'll make it into a headband. This is, this is fabulous. Oh my God. And it's another got gravity works. It's another one of her got fiber pins, but this pin is set up a little differently. So it's round like that, but it's got the different backing on it. So it's got the stick backing or the post backing as it were. So yeah, oh my God, it's fabulous. And I actually don't have any of the ones that have the, um, I think that's Angelina that she threaded through there. I don't know, probably wrong. So, but this is fabulous. Oh, I need to find a, a, a separate project for this. And then maybe whatever's left over will go in the mini skate blanket. But yeah, so that was my mini skein advent calendar uh, from Twin Mommy Creations. I'm gonna hopefully try to turn the camera so that it, there you go. All right there, hopefully my phone does not fall now. So thank you for watching um, and Thank you very much. Um, this was a fantastic Christmas gift and um, that my husband bought me. Yeah, um, in case anybody, if I wasn't clear before, um, yes, even though Anne is a friend, this was bought and paid for, purchased by my husband as my Christmas brother. Okay? Pretty much the only um, thing we got from it for Anne was the fact she wrapped it for him. All right, so thank you for watching. I know I said that, but um, questions or comments, please leave them down below. And I will in the next couple of days have a real podcast video uh, go up with what I have been up to since October. Okay, bye everybody.